turn around, I'm just like, oh, look at that. Oh, oh, wow, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> Don't even think about calling me crazy. You know you peeped that lady. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel, Life of Owls here. <coughs> I'm still recovering from my chest infection, but it's okay. We're still going to crank out these videos same way. So, today I'm doing a try on haul, just a quick little one of dresses that I mainly bought on Black Friday and just dresses that I bought. There's just a collective of dresses that I bought this year, which is not a lot of dresses because I haven't gone nowhere this year like that. Last year was my turn up year, but 2018 I didn't really go nowhere like that. Let's hope 2019 changes that because, you know, you know, I like to dress up and look nice sometimes. I just don't always get the chance to, but it's okay. Um, like I said, I got most of these items on, from blah, 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 from on Black Friday on Old Polly. I got fifty percent off, and then yeah, just Old Polly and Pretty Little Thing. Um, yeah, so let's get started, shall we? The hair that you'll be seeing throughout this video is this lovely dark ash blonde unit that I toned myself, and it's from Supernova Hair. It's the number twenty-seven hair. I did a full video of the colour of this hair and stuff in a previous video, I will link that somewhere. But yeah, this is 27 hair that I toned with my T18 toner. It's a 20 inch three part closure, which Hair Virtue has customised for me and then I just constructed the wig, well, we constructed the wig together, I'll say. It was a collective effort because I did half of it and she helped me the other half because I was just being lazy. But yeah, um, yeah, this is it here. Um, cute hair right I really like this colour it's not like a blonde that clashes with a lot of other things like a nice blonde that goes with a lot of other colours it doesn't clash with any of the dresses I hope I think anyways we shall see in it but yeah the hair's really really soft considering that I took well I tried to box that I toned it and I flopped and then I toned it with well, the toner it's still in like really really good soft condition because uh, I really really flopped trying to turn it the first time so it's been double processed or triple I should say I did the roots as well triple processed and it's still really soft and good I didn't even deep condition it for that long either but if I deep conditioned even longer it would just been extra silky but it's still like look at that we like hair with movements around him don't do stiff weave but yeah that's the hair details make sure to use my code life of Alpha for some money off help your sister out out here and i'm gonna um, put the link for the hair and stuff in the description box and let's get on with the video shall we um yeah this is the first piece i got this from um, in the style, I don't know what this is called, I think it's called the Kimmy, is it Kimmy? It's not Kimmy, I don't know what it's called, it's this Kim Kardashian style neon thing that everybody's been wearing, I thought I'd give it a go and see how it looks on me. I got foundation on it though, so if you see foundation marks in the video, just pretend it's not there, okay? But yeah, I got this in a size 8, I was going to get in a size 6, but then it seems like everybody, all the models were size 8, so I was like, and some of these models were like my size, so I was like, maybe I should just go for a size 8, maybe this is a sign that I should just go for a size 8. So yeah, I'm going to try this on and give you guys my thoughts. So this is the dress. Um, <coughs> I, think this is, I don't know, I can't remember what this dress is called, but it's from In The Style. I got to the size eight, like I mentioned earlier. Um, I don't know how I feel about this dress. Like, I'm not sure. Like, I kind of like it, but I kind of don't. I'm like, mm. Do you know what? I feel like this dress is for them proper curvy babes. And I'm not that curvy like that. I haven't really got tips or anything, which is fine, you know. I'm not mad, God. I'm not angry. Or resentful. It's a really nice clubbing dress. I don't know where I'd wear this. This is like a nice clubbing, like I don't know if I'd go somewhere like proper formal with this. Yeah, absolutely not. But if you want to go out to the club, you know, like swipe them visas, and this is the dress for you. But for formal wear, like a nice upscale place, I personally wouldn't wear this with some club to the club. This would go. But yeah, you sit from the side. Side view. Yeah, to see. So side. Yeah. Oh yeah, another thing I forgot to mention is if you, you've got to be careful just because I don't know if it's just the wrong size of I mean, I got to the size eight, it should be fine. But like you can get some real like um lip slips with this dress. So I'll just say just as you're in the club dancing, keep it cute, just keep holding this up. It's meant to be like an under boob thingy, but I don't like the whole under boob. I think it's a bit tacky. The next item is this dress from O Poly. It's a satin square neck dress. I forgot the name of this. I really forgot the name. But yeah, it's this dress. It's a really figure hugging type of dress. It's one of my favorite dresses ever. I've worn this dress like, okay, I want to say six times as a stretch. I've worn this bare, just bare, just bare, 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 bare,
Alison, get it together. I've worn this dress bare times this year, maybe like more than three times, and I've never got a picture in it, hence why I keep wearing it. Until I get that killer picture for the gram, I'll keep wearing it. Even after I get the killer picture, I'll keep wearing this dress. I want to get it in dresses like this in another colour as well, because it's just the most figure-hugging, flattering dress I've ever worn, like, ever. But yeah, I'll try this on and you guys will see what I mean. Guys, this is legit one of my favourite dresses ever. I feel like it complements my shape so well. Like, I love this dress. And I've never got one picture in it. The only thing I'll say is this dress is not a very super friendly. Like, I've eaten in it, so like, yeah. <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay, I'm human, okay? I've worn, like I told you guys, I've worn this dress bare times. I've never got one picture. It's a shame because I really like this dress. I feel like it complements my shape really, really well. Like, yeah, no, I really like this dress. The only thing is size six is slightly... So ever so just a smidgen too tight like I can breathe in this dress but just about breathe like it's like not a comfortable breathing but it's like enough breathing to keep me alive kind of breathing so from the side and then the back and the side I feel like it goes really well with this blonde hair as well so yeah no really 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 like this dress I think it just makes me look like oh I just look so good he pairs with heels um guys a public service announcement I've noticed people wearing good up good up dresses Good up, good up, nice, nice dresses with um, fur slides. No, guys, girls, stop it, stop it. Just wear heels, okay? Let's grow up now. It's time for us to just firm the heels. If you can't firm heels, then just um, stay at home. Joking, before someone comes to attack me. I keep turning around, I'm just like, oh, look at that. Oh, oh, wow, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, the next dress is a very glam piece. It's this O Poly dress. This one, I remember the name, it's called Drop a Glint. Uh -huh. Oh, look at how this bit's ripped up here. You'll see, listen. I call this dress the Suffocator. Yeah, uh, you'll see why I call it the Suffocator in a second, actually. But like, well, in fact, do you know what? Let me just keep quiet. Let me just try on the dress. You will see why it's called the Suffocator. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, the legendary suffocator dress because I cannot <laughs> breathe in this dress, but it looks so good. I should have got a size eight in this. Hey right, Polly, I've got a bone to pick with you though. Oh, I've got a bone. You said that the model, big titty Sophia, big batty Sophia, shapey hip Sophia. I put a picture of Izzy Glass and see what I'm talking about. So she was a size six in this dress. I thought, okay, me too, I can be a size six then. If she's a size six, I'm definitely a size six. Guys, why can't I breathe? <laughs> You lied to me. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my god. Stop fucking lying. Oh, Polly, you lied. You lied. Oh, you lied. Because <laughs> I can't breathe. But I love this dress. It's so good. No, I really like this dress. I think it's just so nice. So simple yet elegant. Um, this is another dress that my mum's always been inspired of. She's just like, oh my god, it's too short. But as I always say on this channel, mum, sorry. But yeah, this is the dress. I think it's just so elegant. Like, let me show you guys what it looks like from the side. Is it from the side? And then the back. Side, back. It is very short though. But I really love this dress. Yes! Get my life, honey. I'm done though. In the small print, it says, oh, Dolls, this dress runs a little bit tight. Um, go the size up. Should have read that, but I didn't. But so yeah, I say go the size up in this dress because I'm normally then again I'm in between sizes anyway. So if you're in between sizes, go the size up in this dress. So if you're between a six and an eight, get an eight because I can't even. It's not even zipped up properly because I can't even show you guys. It's not even zipped up properly because I just uh, the suffocator. But it looks good. You know what I mean? Who needs breathing when you look this good? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Who is breathing when you look this good? Okay. <laughs> right, the next piece is from Opoly again. I've got this with the Black Friday deal, 50% off. This is Flame of the Game. Flame of Game of the Flame? Flame? Something with Flame. Bandage bodycon dress. I've got this in a size um, s small, but I really wish I got an extra small on the side, but you guys will see my try on the video, but it's still a nice dress. I'm still gonna keep this because it's, it's cute. Elegant, like, ooh, bye bye, ooh. Mm. Bougie, bougie type of dress. So, yeah. Ooh, this dress is cute. Oh, I like this dress. Okay, this dress is interesting because it's got no like pulls or zips. This is just a pull on dress. You literally 
pull this dress on like you would a top. There's nothing on there to kind of secure it sizing wise. Um, I kind of wish I got it in an extra small. Like Michelle, my friend Michelle, if you're watching this, she was all like, no, get it in a size small. You know what old polys like. She was so adamant I shouldn't get an extra small, but babes, I could have got it in an extra small. Because I feel like it's a little bit baggy, but it works. I think I still look nice. I think my shape still looks nice in this dress. You guys let me know what you think. Should I go for a smaller size or is the size okay? But yeah, no. I really like this. Wow. Yeah. Okay. I look so like, like I'm going somewhere fancy. But then again, I don't think I'll go somewhere this fancy with this much cleavage out there, to be fair. But, you yeah, know what I'm saying. This is from the side and the back. Oh, and the back. And then the side again. Oh no, I really like this dress. Oh, Polly, and I got it for half price because of the Oh, Polly Black Friday. If you missed out, then I'm sorry. Sorry. Because, you no. Know, I really like this colour on me as well. I feel like it just looks so elegant, like, mm -hmm, I'm going on some fancy dinner date to Hakkasan or something, I don't know. It's quite similar to the dress I wore on my birthday, actually, funny enough, when I went to Hakkasan. So, yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. All right, oh, Polly, doing the damn thing. All right. Mm -hmm. I can get some nice pictures in this dress. Woo! Next, we have this little a lime green number from oh, Polly and, uh, ooh. Yeah, this is a, this is a, this is, this is a, this is a dress! Um, yeah, I thought this was going to be more yellow, I don't know why, but it's actually very, very green. So I'm going to try this on, and then like, we'll just, I'll give a verdict after I try this on. It's a nice dress, but I'm very undecided about this. It's very bad, I've been popular. Like, if you want to show, if you want to be a showstopper in that room, this is the dress for you. Okay. Ooh, this is, this is a bold one. I don't know how I feel about this. Like a part of me likes it, a part of me is also scared of this dress. Um, I got some foundation in the back, so just let's not pretend it's just pretend it's not there. I don't know how I've got foundation in this already. But yeah. Um, oh no. Oh, this is a bad B dress, but it's very bright. I don't know if I feel comfortable. Oh, guys, I don't know, I'm scared. I don't wear bright dresses like this. Oh my gosh, okay. I mean, it's cute. I, I, no, I like it. I think I like it, but it pulls very green. I thought it'd be more yellow, but it pulls very green. I like it. Oh, I don't know, guys. I'm undecided on this one. It's got these drawstrings that you can pull to tighten the dress and stuff. I didn't really need to. Um, size six fits just perfect. This dress is short, very very short. But no, guys, you guys let me know. What do you think of this dress? Too bright? You're like, I feel like everyone and their mum has this dress, so I thought maybe give it a go. I think it looks extra bright because my lighting as well. But this is definitely to the club, a club, to the club to find like a sponsor type of. I don't condone that sponsor stuff, by the way, but. You know, just for just for the sake of the the, the we gotta let it fly. We, just for the sake of my agenda. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I like this. Undecided on this one. But I've got foundation. It's so I have to keep it anyway. So, but yeah. Okay. You might see me out with this one day when I when I build up the courage to wear it. Okay. This is real slime. This is like a slime season dress. Real slime season. Yes. <laughs> Okay, but the length is a bit mom's mama, my mama gonna be so upset when she sees this dress. Oh lord, mom, sorry. But yeah, okay. 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 Next item is this Ashley Graham Pretty Little Thing collection dress. Again, this is one where the sizing was wrong. I actually wanted it in a size six, but it didn't have it in a size six, so I got it in a size eight, it got a better judgment, and of course it didn't really fit too well. But I'll show you guys. It's a nice dress, but the fit for this is just a no-no for me. Wish I got in a size six, but size six is still out of stock, so I think I'm just have to return this dress and just hope that one day a size six comes in. Or can I get a dress like this altered? Let me know. Is it possible to, if someone who's a, so, uh, a seamstress of some sort, let me know. Can you alter this kind of dress, or is it like an absolute no no? Let me know. Okay, so guys, I really like this dress, but size eight is too big. It's not really big. I don't know. You guys told me, I feel like it's not as big a husband as it could be in this size. I thought like I should really go for a size six, but they were out of stock and I really wanted this dress. I'm sad. It's like quite loose fitting. Like, you guys, oh, I don't know. You guys let me know what you think. I think I should go for a size six. <laughs> My trunk was almost perfect as well in terms of sizing, but I don't know. You guys, you guys told me, what do you think? Do you think I could stay with this size? Do you think I should go for a size six if it comes available again? What should a young girl do? Yeah, I don't know. But I do like the dress though, just not the fit on me at the moment. I feel like, then again, I don't know, I can't, I don't know. 
I don't know, this is, this is undecided, but let me give you a side view anyway. This is it from the side. It's got this pretty little thing to have. I think they put this on here because um, they're tired of influencers buying their clothes, stunning them, and then returning it. So I love doing that. Whoosh. <laughs> but yeah, guys, let me know what you think. This is very another elegant royal dress that you can wear this somewhere like that. Then again, are you allowed to wear cleavage to fancy places? I really doubt it. Y'all let me know. I don't go to these huge places like that, so you know, you, you lot fill me in. Alrighty, gang, thank you so much for watching this. <laughs> <clears throat> Tr mm, mm -mm. This try on haul. I hope um, you got some nice little dress ideas for your New Year's Eve parties. New Year's New New Year's Eve's New Year's Eve parties. That's it. New Year's Eve. Wow. <laughs> New Year's Eve parties. Or like if you're going to the club anytime soon, you know, get it in. I hope I've given you some ideas and some sizing help from different websites and stuff. So yeah, um, this is just a quick one because I'm still feeling a bit under the weather, but I still want to put quick content out there for you guys. So yeah. Um, again, check out Supernova Hair on your way out. The links for the hair will be in the description box and the products and stuff. Um, use my discount code Life of Ours when you're shopping at Supernova. And I will see you in my next video. Pow.